Hey guys, so um, sorry for posting uh, the video so late yesterday, the vlog, and I still don't know if I'm posting a video yesterday, because it's still today, but yesterday it's always weird talking in the future. Um, I don't know, today I just feel like really depressed because I was watching um, 13 Reasons Why and if you know my channel you've been watching me for a very long time you know that <sighs> there was a time when I posted videos about my depression and I talked about my mental self like mental illness and stuff like that but watching that show like triggers me so much it like brings me back to high school and it brings me back to the days where I was a hot mess. Um, I'm still kind of a hot mess, but not. I'm, I got better. But the show's so good. But it's literally like... <laughs> like hitting spots. Like it's triggering me. And all day today, I was waiting for two emails. Because I have some like exclusive information coming out soon. But I just like laid on the couch all day and like didn't really do anything. I ate some pizza, drank some water, laid on the couch and watched 13 Reasons Why and just felt really depressed. And the thing about depression is that when you're in it, you want to get out of it. But there's for, for me, you're in it and then I want to get out of it. But then there's part of me that wants to stay in it because it's comfortable. Because I know that feeling. Because I've known it since I was freaking 10 years old. And it brings you to a place where it brings up such anger and sadness and hatred and stuff. Well, for me, for your hatred for myself. Um, but then, weirdly, it's it's comfortable. It's kind of like being in an abusive relationship you don't want to leave it because you're comfortable but you know it's wrong but with this you can't leave yourself you can't get up and pack your bags and just walk out on yourself um, so that's why I'm like posting real late yesterday and I don't know if I'm posting a video like I said I had to stop watching it. I'm like literally three episodes from finishing the season, but I think if I go on today, um, I don't think I'm gonna hurt myself because that's not, I'm not, I'm not gonna do that. I just, I just, it's just, A few friends reached out to me today. Well, my friend Kristen reached out to me today and was like, hey, you wanna go bowling? And I'm like, no, I'm busy working on videos, which I was technically waiting for emails for exclusive tea but the real reason why I didn't want to go out is because I'm not feeling that great um, being here in LA I know I know a handful of people I know Kristen I know Shelby I know Vegan Cheetah I know who else do I know? I know them. We have, we talk, not every day, but we talk on a regular, kind of. You know, someone that you, you just, I know them. Then I know, then I, then, then I know of and spoke to a whole bunch of other people. People who work for makeup companies, people who just know someone that knows someone but I don't really have that phone call that I can, well, I guess I can, but it's not really like, it's kind of like a new acquaintance working into a friendship type of thing. And I know all the people who live in LA, all the YouTubers and stuff. I know of them. I don't know them personally. I don't have their phone numbers. I just kind of like feel alone. And I knew this was going to come. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. And... It sucks because like whenever, it's so weird, okay, so whenever something great happens to me or I feel so happy and I'm so positive and I'm so on top of everything, the evil demon called depression comes up and sneaks up behind me and brings me all the way back down. 
and then put that on top of moving halfway, more halfway, moving fully across the United States, away from all family, away from everything that you know, by yourself, with your dog. <laughs> um, it's a lot, it's a lot to take in. And I hope that this is just for today. I hope that tomorrow I'm like up and jumping and laughing and joking and hanging out with people. But today it's kind of a down day. Now this is the thing, I'm 28 years old and I'm still fighting, still trying to fight, fight with myself um, off and on sometimes. <sighs> Tristan Mattel is having a album release party, drag queen Tristan Mattel. I can go. I should be going like in a few in a few minutes, <laughs> but I don't know if I'm gonna go. I think it would make me feel better being around all the positive energy, but then there's something like in me that just like is like pulling me back and saying, "No, Sanders, stay on the couch and keep on watching that depressing show." Sanders, just lay in bed. And I know that I said I just want to lay in bed. I want to relax. I just want to sleep. There's a difference between laying in bed and relaxing and sleeping and being happy and getting a rest. And being in bed because you just feel like you don't, your body, you're not in control of your body and mind. And this is not what I was asking for. And you got to be careful what you ask for, I guess. But, um, yeah, I'm just sitting in a bathroom. Because <laughs> bathrooms are relaxing. Usually you sit inside the tub and not outside the tub. <laughs> but, yeah, I don't know what's gonna, what I'm going to do. And I said to myself, you're going to put everything in this vlog. You're not going to filter it and make yourself look like something that you're not and I've been real since day fucking one about everything that I've been putting on my YouTube channel and I'm not gonna stop so I'm gonna be putting this out there and I don't want people to worry about me I don't want people to think oh my god is he gonna hurt himself I don't want people to think that I'm losing my mind like it's just a blip and I'm fine I'll be better um, so hopefully in the next few seconds you'll see a clip of me at Trixie Mattel's album, re album release party. <laughs> or this video will just end and you'll, you'll be getting an exclusive hot, hot, hot video on my main channel with some exclusive things that I can't even talk about just yet. And hopefully it's, it's uploaded in the morning. <laughs> we'll see, it's hard to tell a future. I didn't know I was gonna be like this really. Kind of I did, but not really. Kind of joked about it. You shouldn't joke about depression. It comes back to bite you. But yeah, we'll see what happens in the next five seconds. But I'm gonna go right now and um, this is the end of the video. I'll see you guys tomorrow.